let's calculate the absolute deviation from the statistic distribution we see right here with x sub i and f sub i to calculate it we need the mean which we've already calculated in a previous video it is 2.55 the formula of the absolute deviation is equal to the denominator is n and on the numerator we have the summation of the absolute value of x sub i minus the mean times f sub i n is 20 that's the denominator. For the summation, let's make two new columns. One with x sub i minus the mean. and the other one with x sub i minus the mean times f sub i so for the first value, 0 minus 2.55 in absolute value is 2.55. 1 minus 2.55 in absolute value, of course, 1.55. 2 minus 2.55 in absolute value is 0 0.55. 3 minus 2.55 is 0 0.45 for the next values is it, it is 1.45 and 2.4 what we do next is multiplying this column by f sub i so 1 times 2.55 is 2.55 4 times 1.55 1 6.2 so doing this with all the f sub i's we have 2.55 2.25 and 4.9 now we add all of the results the whole column and it is Twenty-three. So, the numerator is twenty-three divided by twenty is one point fifteen. The absolute deviation of the statistic distribution. The absolute deviation is a measure of dispersion which measures how far the values are from the mean of the distribution.